Good afternoon, I'm Naja Sherman. Thank you for joining us for the CBS News Miami 4 p.m. Quick Cast. We are following a developing story this afternoon, a deadly situation in Pompano Beach. Broward Sheriff's deputies were involved in a fatal shooting along Northeast 4th Avenue and East Atlantic Boulevard. That's where they tried to make a traffic stop. Now, upon locating the vehicle, an attempt or effort was made to stop the vehicle and take the person into custody. And having seen the video of some of these um, very dangerous pursuit that we had today, where the suspect fled and just recklessly was in and out of traffic all throughout Pompano area. Uh, fortunately, our aviation unit did a superb job getting oversight and providing the overwatch, giving us a chance to back away from being too aggressive in a pursuit where someone get killed. And I think that just speaks to why, why it's so important to have an aviation unit here in this county. Uh, of course, the suspect continued to flee. Aviation maintained uh, the overwatch officers on scene continue to have a safe pursuit. Uh, unfortunately, the suspect ended up crashing uh, just a few feet away from where we are now. Crashed his vehicle into one of the concrete pillars. Our SWAT team, who happens to be deployed 24-7, 365, we have out here active, heard the call, was able to participate in what's going to be a vehicle assault, given the suspect instructions to come out of the vehicle. He failed to comply probably after about eight minutes or so of our deputies trying to get him to come out. We also noticed that at some point, it appears he set the uh, car on fire while he was inside, um, based on some of the video footage we've been able to see. And at some point, got out of the vehicle, presented a firearm towards our deputies, and about four of our deputies fired and put the suspect down. No word yet on the identity of the suspect.